Hey guys, it's Clara and I'm here at Haley's house. I'm here um, visiting my dad and um, I'm going to go and show you my fall makeup. So, let's get right. Hey guys, it's Clara again. I already have face makeup on so I obviously will not be showing you that. I'm going to start off with the NYX eyeshadow base and this is in White Pearl. I'm just going to grab a little bit and I'm going to go and I'll put this all over the eyelid like even more up so it's like underneath my eyebrow because I will be applying some shadow there. I'm going to take the BH Party Girl palette and it has a lot of colors and a lot of variety of color and no this is not sponsored but I'm going to take this coppery orange color and I'm going to place that all over the eyelid and this is just as a color base and it's a really nice color so I'm just going to pat that on. Now going back to the palette I'm going to take this yellowish kind of orange color again and I'm going to put that in the inner corner of my eyelid. So you're just going to want to build that color as much as you want. And yeah. But it's enemy shivers. A baby is born. Crying out for its attention. Next I'm going to go back into the palette again. And I'm going to grab this light brown shimmery color. And that is going to be... I'm going to place that on the outer V and then I'm going to bring it into the crease a little bit. So yeah, it might look a little bit sloppy, so yeah, I'm going to obviously blend, but yeah, you're just going to put it in the outer V and then bring it across. And now I blend, yeah! So I'm going to take a blending brush, any blending brush is fine, and I'm just going to go and I'm going to start from the outer part of my eyelid and blend towards the middle into the crease. So yeah, you just want to make sure you blend everything out so it does not look harsh at all. I'm going to go back into the palette and I'm going to grab a matte white color and that is just going to be put on my brow bone just to highlight the area of my eyeshadow and bring out the fall colors that I used on my eyelid. I'm going to now grab an angled brush and I'm going to go into the coppery orange color I used as the base color and I'm going to sweep that on my waterline. Kind of a little bit lower but you get what I mean. Woo! I'm going to now take my white Rimmel London um, eyeliner and this is a really really great eyeliner so you guys should try it but I'm going to use that on my tear ducts and I'm going to bring it a little bit towards the middle of my waterline and that will just highlight my face. The eye look is complete. Yay! So now we're going to go and move on. I'm now going to take my CoverGirl, okay that was weird, <laughs> I'm going to take my CoverGirl um, eyelash curler and I'm going to curl my lashes. And now my favorite part of doing makeup is mascara. Mascara is number one. I'm going to take my Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara by Maybelline and this is my go-to mascara. Um, I'm going I'm to use that as the first coat and this may not work for a lot of people but it works for me a lot. Um, I know Smile Buddies, Haley on YouTube, she, um, it doesn't really work for her because she has small lashes, but if you have long lashes like me, it'll work awesomely. If that was a word. No, that was not. No time to think of consequences. I'm now going to apply a second coat, and this is with a different mascara. This is the One by One by Maybelline, and I'm just showing you the bristle. Yay! That's what it's called. But I'm just going to go and I'm going to rotate the wand thing. I'm going to rotate it. And that's just going to elongate my lashes and make them look more fuller, as you can see. And yeah, I'm just going to do this till I'm satisfied with the length that they give me. Crying out for attention. 
I'm now gonna go back to the Mega Plush Mascara and I'm gonna go to my lower lash line and I'm just gonna give them some love, you know? They need some love, guys. Give them it! And the mascara is done! Woo! I'm now gonna go and grab Haley's LA Color Mineral Blush and that was a little weird, I was being weird, but anyways I'm just gonna take that blush and I'm gonna use circular motions to apply that to my face and I'm gonna smile, awkwardly smile, but anyways, yeah. I'm now gonna take an angled fluffy brush and I'm just gonna blend out the blush cause I felt like I put too much and yeah I'm just gonna blend that out and smile awkwardly. I'm now gonna take my favorite Revlon lip butter and this is in Strawberry Shortcake. I was trying to show you but it epically failed. Anyways, um, that's how it looks like. Why is this taking so long? But anyways, I'm just gonna go and apply that. I awkwardly apply that. I do not know why. I just wanna get a perfect application, if that made sense. No, it did not, but whatever. Just gonna apply that. Kisses for you guys, woo! You guys are awesome. I'm now gonna go and go back and curl my lashes. Um, people think it's bad. I already stated this, but I feel like it's not. If you, if it doesn't, if your eyelashes don't stick to the thing. But yeah, this just elongates my eyelashes a lot, and you will see the results in a bit. The mascara is completely done. You can see that my eyelashes are extremely long. I hope you guys liked my lashes. That is the completed look, guys. I hope you guys liked it. This is my fall makeup routine. This is a go-to for me. But I'll talk to you guys in another video. Bye, guys. Love you all. Mwah. Mwah.